All right, so for this, we are going to go over the trim, split, and project tool. So first things first, trim. Um, trim, let's go with line. We can cut off certain parts right here or trim things out. Let's get symmetry out the way. Uh, you do have other options here, and that's really up to you. But it's like the mask tool before. Um, so let's see. Trim things out right there. So like, let's say you use the mask tool and you like make some colors here. Uh, mask. And then went back to trim. Lasso tool. Oh, you can't actually mess with that. All right. <laughs> Let's go to mask. Invert. Right. Think of trim. That is weird. Wonder why that didn't work. Uh, oh. I guess it doesn't really mix well with uh, masking, but um, it can give you a general shape, and then you can do it again. So that that's helpful in that regard. Um, let's see, go to split. So it's split it it just it it's correct and let's say we we just want like this top piece right here right so then you see how it's kind of like blocked out gizmo yeah you actually technically did split it so if you want to cut out certain parts uh, or you know split your sphere or your figure uh and then create like more objects to work with that's how you go about it um then for projection projections a little weird um so let's say i do that by accident let's oh uh, let's go with rectangles so It kind of meshes things out in a weird way, projects them out from whatever you created. So, let's see. Right, let's see, path. Pro this is going to project it out this way, tap twice. It's certainly interesting, not the best tool, at least that I have at the moment, or that I, that I know how to use, but uh, more power to you. Whew. Yeah, projects, weird, weird, but uh, might be useful to you. So yeah, um, that's... Uh, the trim split and project tool uh hope it helps and best of luck and if you have any questions just uh hit me with uh a comment I'll, i'm gonna try to make some more what call it like actual building thing videos with these tools uh but that